Hi guys, I'm in my grandma's bathroom because I have nothing better <laughs> to sit in. So, um, third My Little Pony video in the row. This is going to be my thoughts, like I promised, on Bread of Discord episode 10, the final episode. I really liked it. It more than makes up for, in my opinion, the worst freaking episode, which was episode 9. Now, I'm going to elaborate what happens in that episode, so, if you don't like spoilers, get out. And skip to a later time. So basically what happens, um, Fluttershy is acting strange after Discord says, GO! And, uh, <laughs> um, then they have, and then she has a nightmare, and the only person who really knows the truth is freaking, um, uh, Princess Luna. And probably someone else, because I'm not freaking paying attention to crap. And then, um, she, after a talk with, um, uh, Princess Luna, Fluttershy decides to go out, go back to Discord, but the main six hear their whole conversation and have a confrontation with her. And, uh, <laughs> not really, it wasn't as big as I thought it would be. They're just saying, oh, we can't believe you're in love with him. And we're like, oh, we completely understand. Rimudak says a couple things. Still doesn't freaking get what she deserves. Fricker. Um, so, then... While they're on their way to go to Discord's Chaos Castle, uh, they get attacked by Timberwolves. Let me just get this out of the way. Why the freak does it have to be Timberwolves all the time? Why can't it be freaking Xenomorphs? Or something else? Xenomorphs would be pretty cool, but they could have been something else. I mean, Timberwolves are so overused. Uh, yeah. So, I'm, uh, Discord saves them from the attack, and they're into the castle, and she and Fluttershy finally co confesses her love to Discord. They get married after that scene, and uh, yeah, and yeah, that's the final episode. It's really good. I really liked it. It's a step up. Good episode. Kudos to you, Disney fan, Disney fanatic, whatever freaking number it is. Uh, so, now there are a few little flaws. So, if you aren't freaking uh, paying attention to the um, uh, series, um, see, there's a subplot with Applejack literally being in freaking love, freaking um, uh, World of Tanks freaking thing. Uh, anyway, she's in love with Spike, legitimately. And... I'm not really satisfied of how that kind of turned out. I mean, the most it goes is her yelling at her like, Oh, I've been in love with Spack! Uh, yeah. So, that's, that's really all it really goes. I would have loved to see a big confrontation when she finally freaking yells out to, like, in front of everyone, I love Spack! And... <laughs> And then the, and then they're like saying, "What? How? What the heck?" And um, uh, and then the Dalek Supreme comes through the door and says, "The abomination is insane." <laughs> That's what I would have done. <laughs> but then there's another small flaw. Fluttershy keeps explaining, "Discord's not a mon monster." But then the keep the ponies keep saying, bringing up, "How could you be in love with them?" when she already explained multiple times, then they just don't freaking get it. And even Discord's in denial, even though they freaking kissed already, how could she love me? Shut up! She kissed you! That's all out the door! So, away with that. Now also, I'm, uh... Let's see, there's something else I wanted to mention. Oh yeah, Rainbow Dash and Rarity. They were like the two major ones that caught. No, Rarity, she freaking's like. Uh, she's all. She almost calls Discord a monster, but he's like, Ma, Discord. Um, I still don't think. I think I would have been really, um, uh. What's it called? Oh, yeah. Satisfied. If. Because Rainbow Dash and, um, uh, Rarity, they're the ones who caused the most trouble, and, um, uh. They're probably the main reasons why the freaking fight happened in, um, uh, episode 9. 
So I would have liked to see them apologizing to Fluttershy, or the whole Maiden 6, saying, Oh, Fluttershy, we're sorry about what, how we meant for Discord. I would have really liked to see that, because I really hate it when Rainbow Dash just gets away with crap without even knowing what she did is wrong. The most what freaking happens in this whole series is this Twilight going Rainbow Dash in her freaking usual fashion. Just freaking get her. You're the freaking princess. Lock her up. It's probably just me not liking Rainbow Dash. She is my least favorite character in the show. I freaking hate her. She's so arrogant. Like Anakin Skywalker. This is outrageous. It's unfair. I want to be a master now. Where? Where? Uh, <laughs> okay, I apologize for that. So, what do I think of the series as a whole? I give it an 8 out of 10. Um, great artwork. Um, I... Also, the guy who, um, the, if you didn't know, the guy who voiced Discord in this series, he dropped out after episode 9 and the new guy. I didn't even know because he was that good. Yeah, he is that good at voicing Discord. I did, I thought he was the same guy, except until I realized his voice was a little bit lighter. And in a, in a couple lines for him, he kind of sounded like Josh Scorcher, or maybe that's just me. So, yeah, eight out of ten. There are a few flaws with it, like that atrocity, which is episode nine. Um, now, what do I think is my favorite episode of the series? It's either. This one, or episode 6? I think it's episode 6. Where Applejack is talking to freaking, um, uh... Zakora, Which is most of the clips I used for my, um, uh... Video. The abomination is insane! So, yeah. Uh, kudos to you. So the only really fan series I'm interested in, or I haven't really found yet, that's still going, is, um, uh, I think, uh, oh yeah, um, Princess Trixie Sparkle. So, I might do a little review on that. If this, and also, th this is the, this is, so far, the, this is the longest episode of the series. It's 59 million minutes. <laughs> 59 mi I can't talk. Um, yeah, so, yeah, it's almost an hour. 59 minutes and 30, 13 seconds to be exact. Yeah, I remember the freaking time for the video. So, yeah, it's been a great pleasure watching your series, Dizzy Fanatic 3664, if I got that right. Great YouTuber. Great stuff. Uh, yeah, this gets the Kobe Romai seal of awesomeness, this series. And, yeah, I have to say, this is, this is the better series. If I, if I were to choose between Bride of Discord and, um, uh... Princess Trixie Sparkle. I'd choose this series. So, well, probably mostly because the voice actor for Pinky is annoying as crap. Did you even Magpie Pony's video? Did you even see the everything you can do? I can do better video. My ears nearly exploded. Yes, I can. Yeah, my ears. I think because of Pinky. My, I'm probably going to go deaf at age 35. But I'm just killing time. So, see you guys in the next video. <laughs> I did not expect my, um, uh, freaking, um, thing. I'm just wasting time.